Welcome once again to Prismatis online class. In this class, we are asked to factorize the following. So we have look at this. This is case three. Case three where b equal to zero. In other words, if you have that a x squared plus b x plus c is equal to zero, where this one is equal to zero, that means you are going to have a x plus 0x plus c equal to 0. Finally, we have that ax squared plus c equal to 0. So that is the case that we are solving. We are solving the case whereby the coefficient of b, the coefficient of s is 0. That means what we have ax squared plus c equal to 0. So we are going to resolve them now, right now. Okay. In solving this question, we are going to look at solution. Solution. Solution A. I will solve A and you will solve the, the other, the remainder. You will solve it. Okay, solution A. The question says x squared minus 4s equal to 0. That means the coefficient of x squared here is 1. The coefficient of b, the coefficient of s is 0. And this is minus 4 is the constant. How do we solve this in? I'm going to solve it in two form. 1. Remember those days in primary school when we are doing differences of two squares. Example, they will give us something like x squared minus y squared. And when we resolve it, it will be like x minus y bracket x plus y. So that when you multiply it, when you expand it, you get back to this. So that is what we are going to use to solve these uh, questions. Okay. That is the first method of solving it, using the difference of what a number. That is, this question will now x minus, there is something inside here, 2, 2, into x plus 2, and equal to 0. The difference of what? Two, uh, 2 squares. So finally, we have x plus, x minus, and we have x minus x minus 2 equal to 0 or x plus 2 equal to 0. The product of two number equal to 0. That means each number is equal to what? 0. So finally, what do we have? This minus we cross the sign of quality. We have x is equal to what? Uh, 2. Or x, this positive number will cross the sign of quality. x will be equal to what? Uh, minus 2. Hence, hence, x equals to minus, x equals to 2, comma, minus 2. And that is the solution to that question. So that is the solution. But this one is just first method of solving it. I'll give you another secret or another method of resolving the same questions. Are you following? I hope you understand it. Now let's try the second method of solving it. The second method here, second method of solving the same questions is this. They gave us that x squared minus 4 is equal to 0. Now, first step here is make x squared the subject of the formula. That is, x squared is equal to minus 4. We cross the sign of quality. We have it as what? 4. Now, we want to get this x, and our problem is this square. So we need to what square root the both sides. If you want to eliminate a square, you use square root. And if you want to eliminate square root, you use square. So we are going to square root the both sides of the equation in order to remove this uh, square. Are we following? Yeah, okay. Now let's go. So what do we have here? Square root of what? X square is equal to plus or minus square root of 4. Reason is that this is a quadratic equation. It attracts what? Plus or, or minus. So that is the reason why we put plus or minus. Now, square, this square root will cancel the square. And the square root x will be now plus or minus. Square root of 4 is what? 2. So we have it as 2. Hence, x is equal to what? Plus 2. Or x equals to minus 2. So they are the same thing. So you need to choose whether you are going to choose the first method or you are going to choose the second method. You only apply this method where, in case where b, 
v from the quadratic equation is equal to zero. In other words, they will give us a x square and the constant. So that is where you are going to apply this method. Thanks and God bless you. Remember to subscribe to Prismatics Online class. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Remember to subscribe. God bless you. Bye-bye.